Sway as weak as. Sway as weak as. Oh, a tide of curses upon this feathered fiend and whatever dank corner of oblivion he flapped from. He owes his thanks to you, traveler. I was just about to kill him, even though he can't die. Exactly what I said. Supposedly, he's centuries old, but the only thing in his empty head are two riddles. They concern a long-lost treasure called the Gloom Lantern. I can't make sense of it, and neither could my crew. Tava guide their souls. Aye. We ran afoul of some dread sails while searching for the damned treasure. Kiko and I were the only survivors. Look, I want to find that treasure and avenge my crew, but I've no mind for riddles. Help me out, and I'll make it worth your while. You look the type to have solved a riddle or two. Now, to get that bird talking, you'll need to prompt him with the passphrase. It's from an old Abishan freebooter saying, no prey to hear his first riddle, no pay to hear the second. Sleeps beneath the shade, in tangled roots of tunneled glade. A stream of fire cuts the trees, yet south of home for he who sees. Pay! Pay! The second piece is within reach, between vaster shores and wind racked beach. Craft approach with spade in hand, hide the cauldron and turn the sand. Sand. Sounds like a load of nonsense, right? Here, let me write them down for you. Vaster shores and wind racked. Huh. If you know you're heading, go on ahead. I'll keep an eye on the bird and we'll meet up with you soon. Treasure! Treasure! Nobody would ever think to look there, unless you had a keen mind for bird-brained riddles. There it is, just like the ri Well, we're two riddles further than we were at the start of all this, thanks to you. What's next? A key, but to what? Show it to Kiko. Maybe he's got another riddle for us. More was four hands. I really didn't think we'd get this far. I'm glad you came along when you did. Look, I wasn't going to actually hurt the bird. Really, I couldn't. I'm a pirate. I've slid a few throats, but Kiko? He's never hurt anybody. Our captain would say I'm weak, but I just can't find it in me to treat Kiko the same way she did. Take no prisoners! No prisoners! Ah! Key! Key! Time for riddle three! The sunwarm side of Singer's Path is where you'll find your prize! Hang Gloom Lantern upon your ship 
to shroud her from all eyes! Wait. I think I know where that is. You've got the key, so we'll meet you there. Unless you want a hint on where to go. Familiar, Kiko? Is this the treasure your master hid away all those years ago? Well, is that what I think it is? That's really it, isn't it? Just like the legend said, I can't believe it. Well, that's it. I owe you a drink at the very least. Don't think I've forgotten that. I'm a pirate, but I'm not the type to go back on my word. I just need to... Secure some funds. That's all. Maybe Kiko can help with that. You hold on to the Gloom Lantern for now, and meet me at the Tavern in Vastir. I knew it. This was all the fault of those damn druids. Over here. A toast to our success before we conclude our business. To the Gloom Lantern. To adventure. To letting no good loot go unplundered. Now, let's get down to business. Now this is the pirate's life I've always wanted. Freedom, drinks, and good company, and clear horizons. And I suppose you have my plunder? Tava's red feathers. I can't believe it. Not only is the treasure real, but Kiko and I actually put our brains together and finished what we set out to do. Of course, we couldn't have done it without you. Here's your reward, as promised, mate. I sort of thought Kiko would flap off after we found the treasure, but it looks like he's sticking with me. Just as well. Seems like things took a turn for the better once it was just the two of us. 